If this is any consolation, Adama State has emerged the best performing state in routine immunization and COVID-19 vaccination. Adama shares the award alongside five other states of Nigeria, one from each of the six geopolitical regions of the country, at a ceremony in Abuja. The Executive Director of National Primary Health Care Development Agency, Dr. Faisal Shaib, stated that Adama was chosen based on the commitment and support of the state government towards improving the performance of routine immunization and other primary health care services. He expressed hope that the recognition would encourage Governor Ahmadu Omar Fentari to continue to provide support to primary health care and routine immunization programs in the state. The Adama state government is deploying all resources, working with its partners to see that we address the health challenges, particularly the vaccine preventable diseases. With respect to maternal and neonatal tetanus, we are launching the campaign in Numan and we are intensifying tetanus vaccination and all other vaccinations across the 21 local government areas of Adamawa State. We are also preparing for OBR outbreak response to the circulating mutant polio virus that was reported in one of the neighboring states. So we are building and guarding our immunity by embarking on another round of outbreak response in the entirety of Adama State, the 226 political wards in the 21 local government areas. We are also intensifying the COVID vaccination campaign in all the nooks and crannies, reaching those who have started but have not completed, and those who are yet to start with these vaccines for the COVID vaccination. Somebody has said it, and it is clear that in immunization today, we are the champion and it's something of pride. <laughs> On the issue of maternal unata tetanus elimination. This is another killer disease that the world is looking at. It is a threat to the growth of young ones to ensure that the status of the country or the states is being made healthy. To that point, we are strongly in support, as I said earlier, that National Public Health Development Agency was able to send about 27,030 doses of TB for this campaign alone. And this vaccine is going to be used. This vaccine is going to be free. This vaccine is effective. This vaccine is efficient. And this vaccine is going to help us to bring down that what we call the United E cases in other states. At least to look at our human resource and also look at how we can be able to manage the financial resource. We know COVID 19 has actually managed to have an effect on our economy. So we look at advantages as a strategy. And that is why all the activities will ensure that the media is able to create demand and inform people what are the necessary things they need to do so that at least we can have a better outcome of all the interventions we are doing in the state. I must also at this juncture commend the state government for their commitment to, in terms of supporting these activities while also commenting our partners. Uh, technical support has been given adequately to the teams in the agency and we have key in all the strategies of uh, the government to ensure that Give Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.